It's going down in the tears now, man. Uh, I'll let your boy, you know your boy, holler back. This is OG Gangster on OG ENT TV. You know what I'm saying? Hit them like buttons when you come in the door. Hit that subscribe button and hit that notification button. So when I'm on, you on. James Cash, what's up, baby? Say salute, OG, SBCC. Much love and respect, big homie. Hope all are staying well by you. Man, I'm good, homie. How you doing, loved one? Mmm. How your baby, how your day been, homie? Aaron, what's up, baby? Say, uh, what's up, G? Huh? What's up, baby? Hub in the dish up. Hey, good. Say, what up with you, homie? CPT for, man, where you been, hey, sir? Huh? Thought you left the country. I ain't seen you in here in a minute. Comrade Mexico, say, G, what up, big dog? What's up, comrade? Amar Amar said, hey, what's up, my dude? What's up, Amar Amar? Huh? There she go. Michelle, what's going on, homegirl? How you doing? Hmm, that's right. Oh. Amar say, good, my G, that's right. Michelle say, what up? Conrad, salute James Cass. Mm. Kaylin Williams say, uh, big homie, much love. Much love for you too, baby. Mm. All to the good, man. All to the good, man. Y'all hit that like button coming in the door, man. Michelle say she doing good. That's right, home girl. Thank Cass say, uh, how you feeling today, big cousin? Man, I'm feeling pretty good, homie. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm feeling pretty good. Benson O'Brien say, uh, what's cracking, cuz? Much love, man. Much love to you too, homie, without a doubt. Mm -hmm. James Cass say, uh, what's going on, Michelle? Salute, queen. So many ways, say, uh, What's up, everyone? Hope y'all making it through through the week good. It's hump day. <laughs> it's hump day today. Get your hump on. Two more days, baby. Huh? Huh? We'll be weekend bound. It's supposed to rain out here this weekend, though. We gonna see. Lamar Lassiter say, uh, my God, what it do? What it way, man? I'm just chilling, man. Richard Wild, what's going on, baby? Say, what's up, G and the G Riders? James Gas say, just a question, OG. Which one of your low riders since you started dipping took uh, you the longest to build? This tray right here? <laughs> this tray right here. This, that, this is the one, the irresistible. That fizz on get kids out his and his eye, his eye is no. <laughs> she did it. Antonio, uh, Antonio McGee say, uh, Art Moore, Oklahoma, 580, is, is tapped back in with you, big bro. Hey, man, shout out to Antonio in Oklahoma, baby. What's going on, homie? Jay Wolf, <laughs> Jay Wolf say, uh, my man, my man OG, what's up with you, brother? And G Riders, hope all is uh, hope all is what it is. It is what it is, baby. Baby E, what's up, baby E? It's OG Gangster tapping in. First out that gym. Yeah, I was here. Hey. No, don't don't, hey, don't thank your boy Slip. I was in that gym at six o'clock. This miss on it, and I'll be that. I'll be back in there tomorrow morning at six o'clock. Yeah. James Cass say salute Richard Why much love. Freshwater Fun say uh yo there's so many 
weird people live streaming right now. I'm glad you're here, man. Hey, man, I'm glad I'm here with y'all, my brother, for sure. Uh, Connect, what did that say? Connect Robinsons? Say, what's up, OG Gangster? Much love and respect. It's your brother from uh, Wilmington, Delaware, huh? East Coast, Big Kenny Robinson, a.k.a. Radio. <laughs> what's up? What's up, homeboy? How you doing, man? Yeah, thanks for tuning in. Abel say, God bless, G. Hey, man, God bless you too, my brother. The real say, salute, G, tapping in like always, and bang that like that like off the back, as you should, man. I and I appreciate that. James Cass say salute. Snoopy Mac, what's going on, King? Uh, CD say, uh, is there still an Orange County Majestics? Nah. Nah. Not no official, nah. Not no official chapter. James Cass say, uh, Good thing we got we got security in here quick tonight. Yeah, for real. Yeah, hit them like buttons and don't play with it. No, 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 no. Say uh, rest in peace, right? HD, whoever that is. Uncut Funk, say uh, I salute you, gangster. Hey man, my salute to you too, Uncut Funk. D, D Ray, D, what did I say? I'm going to just say D Ray. D Ray Adams say, uh, what up already? Uh, what up? I'm ready to ride, riding the tray, this chub. <laughs> hey, we going to ride, baby. Abel said, question, G. What oldie song or jam that brings back good memories when you were low riding with Turtle? Thank you. Uh, man, one of Turtle favorite, two of Turtle favorite songs. Peter Brown, Do You Want to Get Funky? And Alicia Keys, I Want to Thank You, Heavenly Father. Them two songs right there, Turtle, Turtle turned me on to them. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, yeah them, them two of the ones that instantly think about the homie when they come on. By you 504 say what's good G and G riders. No no say uh speak about uh diabol diabolism of uh R. Kelly Puff Daddy Jay Z man hey. end of the day man Ha <sighs> At the end of the day, I cry. R. Kelly is a little freak, but I think R. Kelly just got caught up, man. R. Kelly ain't did shit like Jay Z. I mean, like I mean, uh, like P. Diddy. You know what I'm saying? He ain't beat no bros and drugged them, made them have sex with other people. And I, um, most of them bros is R. Kelly, man. They came in with eyes wide open, man. You know what I'm saying? They came in with eyes wide open, and some of them came in trying to trick him, trying to get a quick come up. You know? And that, and that's real. That's real. You know, as far as uh, Jay-Z, you know, his saga is yet to come. You know, we don't know his story yet, but it all, I'm pretty sure it's going to come because everything done in the dark come to the light eventually. You know? Yeah, but uh, Puffy, Puffy, Puffy's a man. Puffy is a <laughs> Puffy is a maniac. <laughs> and you know what I'm saying? Puffy gonna get everything. Cause not not even just the, the 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 women. You know what I'm saying? How he fucked over so many people in his life. How he had people blackballed so they couldn't make money. You know what I'm saying? Just check this out, man. All the artists Puffy had, man. All the artists he had, man, ain't none of them did nothing once they left Bad Boy. And I can't see, I can't see all them artists that 
had all of them had good uh, uh, solo albums, good albums. I can't see any of them not being able to make no more good music, man. Puffy messed over a whole lot of people, man. You know what I'm saying? But it's, you know, every dog has his day. Every dog has his day. Yeah, did he did it, huh? Conrad makes you say, is that Chubb with the great rag folk? Nah, uh-uh. Andre Stewart say, uh, what's up, OG? I heard that Ice Cube shit. I am with you, big homie. Damn shame. Yeah, it's a damn shame, man. It's a damn shame. You know why he, why he couldn't get a sister? It's crazy, man. Them, man, them, you ain't going to get no more sponsors because you get her. All you going to do is get her. She going to get that $5 million, and she going to get sponsors. They going to see the one going to get the sponsors. <sighs> Boy, it's crazy. Hmm. Yeah, Alicia Myers. I want to thank you, Heavenly Father. No, no, say Usher, Justin Bieber, and very crazy hissy. Yeah, well, you know, my thing is this. I don't know why Usher. Usher must just like, he like being a gay. He trying to play like he ain't gay, ain't want to hump all on Alicia Keys' ass and go fuck around with all these women. You know what I'm saying? I can understand P. Diddy took advantage of you when you was little. And you couldn't do nothing about it. But you a grown ass man now. And you still running up in his face. You still going to his parties. You still giggling with him. Why you ain't putting your foot in his ass? Somebody answer that. King Hazy Only Hayes YouTube channel say, uh, OG salute, peace up, uh, peace up and peace up and respect. Hey man, what's going on, King Hayes? Uh, only Hayes, baby. How you doing, my brother? James Cass said, I don't play when it comes to the devil. The mofo is a liar and need to stay up out of mind. A liar and a thief, without a doubt. Conrad Maceo say, R. Kelly was a dummy. He carried his evidence around with him. <laughs> R. Kelly ain't nothing as bad as they ain't nowhere near as bad as Puffy, though. That's real. Lamar uh, Lassiter say, uh, it's sad to say, but we the only race that don't stand tall for each other. It's either hating or don't want or don't want the less the next to end up better than them. Stuff is weird. Yeah, it is weird, homie. Keith Johnson say, salute OG, money is the root of all evil. It ain't the money, it's the individual, man. You know what I'm saying? The individual is just scandalous, period, itself. You know, because money can't make me do nothing. I've been offered money to kill motherfuckers before. <laughs> and I was like, man, I'm not the angel. I'm not doing that. I'm not no motherfucking hit, man. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> uh-uh. You know, and that all money ain't good money. You know, but you know, this was when I was back a youngster. I think, I think I was like 19, 20 years old. Paul say, a oh, bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what he gonna do, but he better figure out something. Huh? He better figure out something. Conrad say, it's gonna be a plot twist. On this puffy stuff, watch. Huh. James Cass say, it's the motive behind the money that's evil. The money ain't evil. The money is just in, in evil hands. Went in in abundance. You got that right. Uh-huh. Uh, the trail walker say, what it do, G? True story. Keith Johnson say, uh, they thought because uh, they have the top dollar, they can mess over the bottom. Now they, they have to literally pay the piper. Hey, man, you put, uh, 
You give any man and you give anybody some power that ain't never had none, they gonna always abuse it, man. Lil Kenny CC say, uh, what it do, G? I just uh seen your short plenty of sisters playing that ball and cube chasing white. He said, Yeah, yeah, sad. Now D Ray Adams say, uh no, but I got a 64 rag, 61 rag I'm working on, homie. That's right. The trail walker say, Unc, Dale Dog saw it back then. Man. And for Ru Thomas say, uh, he on some bullshit. Little legend say Diddy was a real gangster. <laughs> man, ain't nothing gangster about Diddy, man. He's just a sucker with some money. Ain't nothing gangster about Diddy. Because <clears throat> if he was, he wouldn't have moved the way he was moving. <clears throat> Maurice Bourne Sr. say, what's up, G? I'm checking in. What's up, Maurice? Benson O'Brien say, what's with Ice Cube? He should be doing what Snoop doing with the youth league, but with Batman, he ain't doing shit. I'm doing that with basketball. I got, I'm got. i starting my own basketball summer league. You know what I'm saying? For the summer to get a youngster something to do. And everything is free. Baby, he say, uh, yeah, Diddy lost my respect years ago for not giving Biggie moms Writes and publishing to his music. Yeah, that's because he is greedy. That's because he was greedy. Andre Stewart say, uh, check this out, OG. My mother told me it's never the wrong time to say the right thing. Thing, do you? Uh, salute. No, it ain't never the wrong time to say the right thing. Uh, yeah, I agree with that. Keith Johnson say R. Kelly ain't did nothing compared to what Puff did. That's real. That's real. Given life, so 706 say money is not going to save you. It saves It depends on the situation. <laughs> It depends on the situation, because enough money can save, so depending on what it is. Jay Wolf say he sprung out for P. Diddy. Now he can let it go. D. Ray Adams say uh, a pile of money is like a pile of shit, but if spread it out, it's fertilizer. Mm, you got that right. No, no, say, uh, are you Morris? No, I'm Christian. But I don't even really, I, I really, I'm, I'm just a man of God. And I follow Jesus Christ. We God's riders over here. Emperor Thomas say, uh, T.D. Snakes on his knees for show sure. now. Yeah, yeah. He, he coming. All, that, all of them time coming. Tom McGuire say, maybe we can... All buy Bibles from Donald Trump. I think he needs the money or they convicted rapists. Man, listen, man. Donald Trump is fooling, man. Donald Trump got some money. Donald Trump just don't want to spend his money. That's why he coming up with all kind of different bullshit to try to raise money off of the suckers that's going to pay for what he's selling. Man, believe me, it ain't nothing for Donald Trump. He should be good. He listen, man. Donald Trump should be able to go right there to his daughter and her husband and ask for $400 million. All the money they made when Trump was in office overseas? Man, man don't be fooled, man. Don't be fooled. Pallone, Compton City. Jeez, what's up, Pallone? Say, gangster, my baby, my baby Jesse and Angel said, what's up, man? What's up, Jesse? Baby Jesse and Angel, how y'all doing? Hey, what about them Raiders, baby? Ha <laughs> ha! Raiders! <laughs> what about them Raiders? 
Huh? Motivation say Ice Cube proof he ain't straight out of Compton. Man, Ice Cube ain't never was straight out of Compton. He was Ice Cube ain't never been from Compton. Devil Wright say, uh, you look like smell look like no motherfucking Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg look like a Doberman pincher. And <laughs> you got me fucked up, Deborah. <laughs> Excuse my French. <clears throat> Jaden Kern say, gee, what's your favorite memory of Turtle, man? Man, that shit, every, every, man, damn near every memory was a favorite memory of me. You know what I'm saying? But my my favorite memories, you know what I'm saying, was the first time I got in this low rider, which was the first, first low rider I got in was his low rider. You know what I'm saying? And we went dipping. That's my favorite, that's my most favorite memory, you know what I'm saying? EC Money say 5000 5,000 or a dinner with Jay-Z. Motherfucker got to be out of their mind, man. Man, give me the money. I don't want no damn dinner with Jay-Z. You know what I'm saying? That don't just, that ain't, get, get, give me a guarantee that something going to come up out of it financially that's worth more than 5,000. And then I go take the dinner. Other than that, it's the hell out of here, man. James Cash James said, Caleb, my brother, Good to see you, King. Love and respect. Young Caleb, what's up, baby? What's going on with you, young Caleb? Uh-huh. Giving life, say, I can't wait for Jay-Z to get caught up in the, the, the shit next because he's another one of them. And then go to Dwayne Wade next. <laughs> Listen, man, Jay, man, motherfuckers think Jay Z, Jay Z got some lyrics. Yeah, he got a little flow, but I seen a, I seen a, a video the other day, man, about Jay Z wasn't doing nothing but biting lyrics off of Biggie, man. I, they played like eight songs where Jay Z bit the lyrics from Biggie. Come on, man, ain't no real rapper doing that, man. Ain't no real rapper doing that. Kenny say hi, hi to you. Well, okay, what's up, Kenny? Maurice Bourne say love Jay Z missing. Say LOL Jay Z missing. He have already told on himself. Shit, he missing. What can he do? Shit, he don't want to be involved. He trying to stay out the way so they don't look at him. His bet is his best bet is to stay out the way. But but everything coming up out that closet, man. Hit them like buttons, y'all. Pallone, Compton City G, say a Raiders. Raiders all day, baby. What's up? Huh? Jay Wolf say God's Riders, and that's for real. Giving life, say, oh, that means you're Islamic or I self Lord the map. Man, I'm not Islamic. <laughs> I'm a follower of Jesus Christ, man. God. Conrad Maxwell say, yeah, Donald Trump playing broke. Yeah, he is, man. Donald Trump ain't broke, man. O'Neal, he was making money the whole while he was in office. Psst. Man, y'all can believe Trump broke if you want to. O'Neal Williams say, what's good, gangster? What's up, O'Neal? Campo, huh? Shalom, Adon Adonai. Okay. Buy you 504 say, uh... Puff a gangster wannabe. He, he the reason Biggie got smoked. I would have top security on my top dog or got him out of law. Man, listen, man. Everybody and their mama know the biz, Puffy ain't had no business bringing biz, Biggie to motherfucking Los Angeles, especially right after Tupac then got killed, man. No, and then you got this, you got this big ass nigga in this little tight ass suburban, old ass suburban. Why y'all ain't in a limbo blacked out or something blacked out? And he on the driver's side, passenger side. He's so big you can't help but hit him if you shoot, man. Man, Puffy knew exactly what the fuck. Man, I'm telling you, before this all over, man, 
Puffy might have some murders, man. And that's real. You know, I don't wish nothing on nobody, but at the end of the day, fuck Puffy, man. Because he's a dirty, scandalous motherfucker, man. See how he did Craig, let Craig Mack did Craig Mack? Man, Puffy's a dirty motherfucker, man. You know what I'm saying? Whatever happened to him, he deserved it. He got it coming. Jay Baru say, uh, Trump broke. He got like 100 lawsuits, man. Trump ain't broke, man. Trump playing broke. E. Bullock say, uh, what's good, OG? Man, I'm oh, mad. Shit, you good, man. What's going on with you? Robert Richards tapping in, OG. What's up, Robert Richards? Giving life, say Snoop Dogg. Hey, I ain't, I ain't got time for that dumb shit, man. Go somewhere else and play. Bro, say, uh, you know Berserk. Lamar Lasseter say they don't want to give a person like you a chance because they know you're going to do right with it and bring more folks together while doing it and going to keep it all the way Real off rip, without a doubt, man. I keep telling motherfuckers, man, that look, man, how much, how much money is enough, man? Once you got your house or your couple of houses, because see, I don't want a mansion. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody here but me and baby. I don't want no mansion. All of me, you know what I'm saying? Me a good, good, nice four bedroom with a with a with a den, or in the basement. You know I'm cool. Once you get your house, buy your little cars, if jury, if you're in the jury, and buy your clothes. Man, listen, man. Tyler Perry, Oprah Winfrey, Jay Z, all them billionaires, man. How much money is enough, man? Cause see me, if I had money like that, I'm gonna take care of my family. But I'm going to be like this here. I'm going to buy all y'all going to get a house that's paid for. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to make it to where I can't none of you motherfuckers sell them. It got to go down from, from generation from generation to your kids to their kids. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to make sure my people are taken care of. And I'm going to put all of, give all of them some money. You know what I'm saying? Enough money for them to start their own businesses or do what they want to do. You know, and after I do that, I'm finna go out and 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 and, and, and start spreading the money. Oh, what am I doing a billion dollars, man? Once you have everything that you done accumulated, what you man, you old man, <laughs> shit crazy, man. Hey, I'm finna get get this motherfucker no no off of here, man. With all this negative shit about Snoop, you don't know you don't know nothing about Snoop, my brother. So hey hey, get this motherfucker up off of here, somebody. Keith Johnson say L O L O G said a Doberman pincher and Snoop does look like yeah, I don't look like no motherfucking Snoop. That's the homie, but I don't look like him. M say, can I get a shout out? What's up, M? Shout out to M. O'Neal Williams say, uh, Cube of uh, Van Wick. Oh. <laughs> Over there in, in West Athens. <laughs> Homie first say, uh, uh, checking in, OG. You ain't gonna never find Q but no West Hamptons, partner. Huh. He ain't in the hood. Uh, Maceo, Brazil checking in. What's up, Brazil? No, got much love for you, my brother. Holy Mary said hi. What's up, Holy Mary? Yeah, I love God too, man. Macy O'Keller say, uh, Neymar, bro. What the hell is Neymar? 
giving life, say, I love my state. I can't wait to come back home to visit. That's right. Jasmine uh, Portlock say, hey, greetings from Cleveland. Man, shout out to Jasmine in Cleveland. How you doing, Jasmine? Keith Johnson say, Jay-Z was, uh, was biting off of Nas. Yeah, Jay-Z been biting off of Big L, Nas, Biggie. Man, that's, man. Mike Lorenzo say, Jay-Z. And Diddy going to be uh, doing burpees. They going to be doing something. Killer Vision say, oh, man, please keep listening to Sugar Hill. Huh? One band, one sound. Giving Life say, uh, you get close to Jay-Z, he's going to do you like Puffy, Puff Daddy. Our brother love, Jay-Z ain't going to do a motherfucking thing to me. <laughs> I don't play them games at all. No, yeah, at all. Benson O'Brien say, we need more community leaders like you, G. You're a real one, homie, hands down. Appreciate you, my brother. Hey, we're going to go on. We're going to go on and get to the topic, man. Rodney Scott, what's up, man? Rodney Scott say, uh, the last era I... Ice was in was that was close to black people, and and that was Baldwin Hills, and that was like 20 years ago. Yeah, for real, he ain't around no brothers. Huh? Say Cali, my second home. That's right. KSLM say, uh, do brothers fix up old Chrysler's like you do 64? It depends on what you like. You know what I'm saying? If that's what you like. Giving life, say, don't get mad at the truth, OG. It's the truth. What the hell is you talking about is the truth? What, what are you talking about is the truth? Motivation, say, who painted Irresistible? The uh, candy man did. Say, I'm a Kelly boy. I was around Snoop. Can't tell me nothing. Can't tell you nothing about what? Can't tell you nothing about what. Given life, say I was around when Snoop Dogg had his issue back in the day when his house got shot up. Yeah, that, yeah, I'm that type of guy. I'm not just sitting there talking shit out my mouth. I don't care if you're talking shit out your mouth or not. What the hell they got to do with anything? At the end of the day, you know, I got fucked with Snoop. No matter, regardless of that, you might have been at it. Well, how, well, how, where else you been, nigga? Who else can you call out? I can call out motherfuckers all, all, all over California. You know, they, we all know Snoop ain't no gangster like that. You know what I'm saying? But I know some real motherfucking gangsters that I know you couldn't sit down with. <laughs> man, hey, man, let me go and get to the topic, man. You 43, man, I'm 61, man. Talking about you got a whole lot of knowledge, you 43. Man, knock it off, man. <laughs> Let's get to the main topic, man. You know what I'm saying? The main topic tonight, man, is why we won't help each other, man. <laughs> Third Eye TV say you buy your family house and they want you to help maintain it. All I'm going to do is buy them the house, put them in a position to do good, and boy, that's on them after that. You know what I'm saying? That's real. You know what I'm saying? Hey, but at the end of the day, man, why we can't, uh, why, are, why we don't help each other, man? You know what I'm That's why I'm mad. They can't get me out of my character, homie. You know, he, he talking about some little bullshit. He ain't got a clue. He ain't, he can't even go where I can go. <laughs> For real, he can't go where I can go. <laughs> but listen, man. But uh, you know, no disrespect. We got to, you know, everybody got a right to their opinion. You got a right to yours. I got a right to mine. I'm not mad at you at all. You know, I'm saying James can say my opinions on brothers and sisters with the big dough not helping is because their money is controlled 
by gatekeepers, uh, superiors, and man, listen, man. Listen, man. Motherfuckers can do what they want to do with their money, man. Can't nobody tell me what to do with my money that I don't know. Look, man, these people are so rich. Tyler Perry, Oprah Winfrey, Jay-Z, Beyonce, even Ice Cube. All of them, make, they got so much money, homie. They ain't got, man, come on, man. Can't no, if they don't make another dime, they all right. Oprah Winfrey can basically damn Oprah Winfrey can live off off the the, the motherfucking uh, interest on her money, and that's real. That's real. Oprah Winfrey can live off and Tyler they can live off the interest. They ain't got to spend a never take another man. Hey man, but what? Look at man. I'm gonna tell you something, man. We got a whole lot of rich black people, man. And ain't no, listen, man. Ain't nobody asking you for your money. All we asking you to do is create. Create so you, so you still will be getting money, man. Why we ain't got no market franchises? We say, okay, Oprah, okay, Oprah you do the market franchises. You know what I'm saying? Tyler Perry, you do some other franchises. You know what I'm saying? Jay-Z, Beyonce, y'all do some other kind of franchises. I'm just saying. And then just hire all blacks like everybody else do. You go in an Asian restaurant, ain't nothing working but they family. Asians. You go into a, into a white person's restaurant, ain't nobody working but what? Listen, man. We do the same thing that they do, man. We do the same thing that they do. We open up our businesses and then all we do is hire our people, man. Why we ain't got our own market franchise? I ain't, you know what I'm saying? You got to open something that you know going to be there for this. It's going to be there forever. People going to need a service or a product. You know what I'm saying? You got to make sure it's a service or a product that people going to need. Morris Bourne say some people can't help because they ain't never had nothing to have big things. You have to work with others. Hey, at the end of the day, hey, we going to set it up to where they going to be trained to work with others. You know what I'm saying? And if a motherfucker don't act right or don't do right, he get fired just like he get fired at any other job. But we still bring another brother or sister in, you know? Jesse say, and they feel like because they did it, some someone else. Yeah, a lot of these idiots feel like it. That's that Terrence, Terrence. Uh, I mean, uh, Clarence Thomas syndrome. I pulled myself up from the bootstrap. Everybody can't pull themselves up from the bootstrap. Everybody not the same. Everybody wasn't raised the same. Everybody don't have the same trauma. Everything ain't. Everybody ain't been through the same things. You know what I'm saying? And that's what you got to understand. Vincent O'Brien say people are too selfish these days. We all need to work together to bring peace to our community. Without a doubt. King Cobra say, uh, hey, hey, my brother, blacks have a lot of businesses that we really don't. King Cobra. I have not said blacks don't have businesses. I bet you them businesses ain't, ain't everybody working in there ain't black. I can bet you that. I bet you there's more others working in them black businesses than blacks working in them. And that's real. We talking about some real businesses, franchises and shit like that, man. Just like Rick Ross. He got all them damn uh, wings and things. He should have everybody and every one of them motherfuckers working black. You got 30 wings and things. Every one of them, everybody working. That's, listen, man. That's how the Mexicans do it. You go up in McDonald's, they got a, they got a damn uh, Mexican supervisor. And they really bet your ass he or she hiring everybody Mexican. 
How you think all the corporate corporate is not hiring these people, man? You can go in every Burger King anywhere you want to go. And, it, and I guarantee you, if the supervisor is Mexican or white, then that's what you got up in there, man. That's real. Mike Lorenzo say, it's enough money out here. For, yeah, it's enough money. You know what I'm saying? But we, we, don't, we don't even support each other, man. That's why a lot of black businesses go out of business. Because we don't support each other. And man, and I get me, I mean, you know what, man? A lot of businesses, they do need, well, black businesses, they, 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 they need some training. They do need training, man. Because I'm going to tell you, man, it's a fucking, uh, Hamburger stand and watch. That watch hamburger stand right there on motherfucking Central, right across the street. You know what I'm saying? From what I still call it, well, well, it's, uh, they changed the name. It was Real Rogers Park, but they changed the name to a black person name. You know what I'm saying? And they got some good ass food, man. But damn near every time I go, oh, we out of chicken, or oh, we out of this, and we out of that. You was just open yesterday. Made money. Why you didn't go re up? I'm just saying, some of some of us that open these businesses, man, we just not knowledgeable. You know what I'm saying? And the place got good food, man. Oh man, I'm telling you, I'll be getting them turkey burgers and them tur them turkey tacos off the chain. Shout out to what the Watts Burgers, right there on Central, across the street from the park. I right off of Central in the 103rd. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, they got some good shit, but every time I go, they out of something. You know what I'm saying? We got to step our game up, man. O'Neal Williams say, man, mofos be hating when you doing some good. I'm from Alabama, and it be your own family. Man, man, listen, man. Family and your friends going to hate more than anything, man. You know how many people that I know are people that think they know me? You know what I'm saying? Why my books ain't bestsellers? Because anybody that done read them or tell you, nigga, they top of the line. Anybody that ordered my book, if you don't like it, I'll give you money back and you can keep the book. I know my shit is just top of the line, man when it comes to writing these urban novels, because I done been there and done that. I lived this shit. I know how shit go. You know, I know how to tell a real story. You know? But at the end of the day, not even a quarter of the people that I know. People that buy my books is people that I don't know. People from out of state. People that's in different cities or whatever that I don't know personally. The motherfuckers I know personally, they ain't buying nothing. They don't want to see a nigga but, uh, make it, but I'm going to make it regardless. Because this is the fucking internet. The internet takes you to the whole world. That's what they fail to realize. You know what I'm saying? I got several things cooking. <laughs> cooking. <laughs> and when it's done, hell to the O. Huh. Hello. You know what I'm saying? People. They'll be trying to come around. Hey, huh? No. No, no, no. You ain't fuck with me. I ain't fucking with you. You know what I'm saying? Plain and simple. You know? I'm going to see you and I'm going to keep on speaking to you and I'm going to talk to you because you know I learned a long time ago. Love plenty and don't trust any. You know what I'm saying? I learned that a long time ago. But I want to sh I want to shout out and say thank you to all the people that I don't know that continue to support me, buy my hoodies, buy my books, buy my caps, all that, man. I want to thank y'all, man, and I appreciate y'all. You know, but for the, all these motherfuckers that act, oh yeah, what's up, G? Oh, what's up, big homie? Oh, what's up, homie? Oh, love one, man. He, 
I ain't tripping, man. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, I'm a real hustler. I've been a hustler all my life. I'm just hustling legal now. If I could do it illegal, I damn sure can do it legal. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not tripping. I'm enjoying life. Building lowriders, having fun. You know what I'm saying? Why you saying motherfuckers is hating? Still ain't got nothing. Ain't got nothing. How about that? Huh? Shit, Woo say, hey, Unc, what up? What's up, homie? Beanie Boy say, we need Jesus in the cruel world like this. Jesus in there. You just got to get him. Jesus is definitely here. Yeah, grocery outlet, it's a franchise. If you franchise it, anything's a franchise that you put multiple of the same things out there. Quick to be silver, say real facts. I love what you're saying. Mike Lorenzo say that's facts. Jesse Beeman say, but I think the biggest reason is, yeah, is selfishness. And selfishness, and you know what I'm saying? And if one, that's, that's the only thing about brothers and sisters. They feel like, oh, I did this on my own. You ain't did shit on your own. Everybody out there that's been a success has got help by somebody. Somebody has helped you in some kind of way. And that's real. Christine Williams say you right. Homie Fresh say no trust, my G. Yeah. Robert Richards say that's right. Antonio Williams say he's a share owner, not a CEO. Devin Clay say, I appreciate what you're preaching and how you're preaching it. Jesse Beeman say, yes, they do it at my job. I know they do it at your job. I see it. Anytime I walk in the establishment and I see a motherfucking white person that's a manager or, or a Mexican person that's a manager and I look around, I can see it off the top. I already know what's happening. Lemanuel Young say, Rick Ross, the rapper, is not black American OG. He, he a tether. <laughs> Kenneth Morgan say that's 1,000. Christine Williams say black people have to learn how to service people. That man, anybody can be taught anything. You know what I'm saying? That's real. Open up these businesses and, and teach them. That's all. Because listen, man. You only know what you know. If you haven't been taught something or you don't understand something, how you going to change? You only know what you know. Sometimes you just got to teach a person, man. Like these youngsters out here in these streets. These youngsters don't like the way they living, but it's all that they know. But if we come together and teach them something else, Teach them how to be a plumber. Teach them how to be an electrician. Teach them how to be a mechanic. Then they'll know something else. And they won't have to go back to the, to the nonsense. Mike say, yeah, we support every other race but ours. And that's real, man. We support every other fucking race but ours, man. You know? And if you try to even go boycott a store, one of these little Asian stores, you still going to have some brothers and sisters trying to get up in there. But like I said, a lot we only know what we know, man. When you know better, you do better. And you know what I'm saying? And that's real. And we got to teach each other, man. So we can know better, so we can do better. Maurice say... Us as black folks have to respect the other blacks and to get respect from others. If if they black don't along don't along it with don't along it will never work. I don't understand. You gotta rephrase that, man. Dunkley family say a uh, good day from Australia, my American brother. How you doing, Dunkley? Shout out to Australia. Jesse Beeman say, uh, 
and stubbornness, without a doubt. Lamar say, uh, we we got to go to jail for us to link up and put the put the BS aside. Yeah, for real, man. For real. Because when you go to jail, everybody is against us, man. Even administration, even the police, everybody is against us, man. And that's real. I done did 26 years in, in and out of jail. I know for a fact, everybody is always against us. Antonio Williams say, uh, no, not true. Most black businesses charge high prices for their product, and they haven't even built a reputation for people to, to, to come. Look, man, they prices, they price, man. You gonna respect them white folks' prices, Antonio? You gonna respect them white folks? Every fucking thing is high. A little donut that I used to buy when I was a kid that was five cent is a fucking dollar fifty. A glazed donut that used to cost a five cent. Them little honey buns that used to cost thirty cent. Them motherfuckers is two ninety nine, three something. And they say jumbo on them, but they not even big. They say jumbo and they little as fuck. Somebody should be suing hostess. I'm just saying, man, that's our problem. We always complain about our people's shit. Everybody got high prices, homie. Everybody. So many ways say, uh, yeah, they getting uh, rid of all the black workers in my neighborhood. I'm telling you, man. Mike Lorenzo say, uh, my black-owned businesses will be beautiful thing for our community, all black work, man, for real, man. We got to do just like they doing. You know? Kenneth Robertson say we don't even support a black-owned corner store. It's a damn shame. Yeah, it's a shame. But you'll run your ass straight up into that Asian store, a motherfucker that don't like you, and if he think you're stealing something, he gonna shoot you. You'll run right up in there and get him all your money, and they don't put a dime back in the community. That's why damn near every Asian store in our communities out here holler that cash only. Cash only. For one, they don't want the government to know what the fuck they making. You know what I'm saying? And for two, they going to take the cash up out the community. Oh. Quick to be silver, say uh, Christian Williams. Pause, my God. Christian Williams what? I ain't got time to be pausing. Cornelius, uh, Cornelius Crump say watch burgers. Yeah. They got some good burgers. Yeah. Good shit over there. Keith Johnson say, uh, we as black people need to get it together and take heed to what you're speaking. Real shit, bro. That's because, listen, man, whenever a black man or a black woman is on here talking some real shit, man, first thing a black person want to do is dispute it and shoot it down instead of really listening to it and like, oh, okay, well, okay, you know, let me at least check it out. First thing a brother or sister want to do is shoot some shit down or go against it. That's our problem now, man. That's our problem now. Dot Smooth, what's up, baby? King Cobra say amen to that. Tra oh, let me see. Maurice Bourne say, I forgot the black queen name, but... She owned a lot of McDonald's in, in South Central Compton. It was uh, passed down from her mother. It was on the news morning. Yeah, well, she need to get her ass up off of her, wherever she at, and go to them fucking black ma them McDonald's and, and get rid of the motherfucking the, the, the Hispanic or the fucking uh, white, whoever's in there white. Or either just tell they ass y'all need to get some brothers and sisters up in here. For real, for real, man. That's exactly what she need to do. Tell them they need to hire some brothers and sisters too.
Keith Johnson say class is in section. Random guy say, I love your mama, love your friends. Say, love your mama, love your friends. Respect and manners, and you're going to be a great man. Without a doubt. To this day, I, I, don't, I don't curse around my mama to this day. Never have, never will. And, I, and even, you know what I'm saying, if it, brothers that I see that's older than me, I'm, I'm man, I respect, I respect my elders, man. You know, that's just the way I was raised. Dunkley family say, good day from Australia, my brother. I thought us Australians, blacks, had it bad. To me, you African Americans are the bravest, strongest colored. I know you live in a racist country. At least we have respect, without a doubt, man. And I feel you on that, brother. Andre Stewart say, oh, gee, you be killing the sweater game. Oh, yeah, man, yeah. This is my son brand right here, man. Baby gangsta everything. BG everything, baby. Yeah. Mike Lorenzo say, G Riders on the move. More black owned businesses with all black workers will improve our communities. Without a doubt, man. Without a doubt. But why is why we ain't got nobody? We ain't got no fucking body. Like Shaq. Shaq got a whole lot of businesses too. He need to start making sure brothers and sisters is up in there. All you, all you, all you black brothers and sisters with money that got businesses, man. Y'all need to make sure you got black brothers and sisters working there, man. Find them till you get the right ones. That's all. King Cobra say, uh. Everyone could use a little help. That's real. Y'all hit them like buttons. Sig Wine say, right? Jay Wolf say, oh yeah, I'm going to fall into one of those hoodies and caps. Got to have one. And it's all embroidery. This ain't no stick on. This is all embroidery, baby. Mike Lorenzo say we need more black businesses in our community. Yeah, we do, man. I'm going to tell y'all, man, look, all we got to do, man, is boycott the Asian businesses so they can get the fuck out of here because you ain't going to find one black business in the Asian neighborhood. Not one. You ain't going to find a black period in the Asian neighborhood. I ain't got nothing against them. I'm not racist against them. At the end of the day, I'm pro-black, I'm for my people. We need to handle our business so we can make us better. Or we need to boycott every business. And if, if, they, if, if they ain't making no money, they gonna leave. And when they leave, you know what we do? We open up that same exact business. And we keep it rolling, man. And we keep it rolling. Freya say, oh, do you believe Jesus is Christ? Well, shit, his name is Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus, yeah, I believe Jesus is Christ. One band, one sound, G. Ryder stand up. Connect Robinson say, OG Gangster, real talk. Yes, blessed the internet. Without it, I would, I would never meet, met you I, on the other side. And yes, you are really cool. Cool. Hey, thank you. I appreciate you, man. I appreciate you, Connect. Thank you. I thank you. And hey, it's my pleasure. Mike Lorenzo say we need we need our own corner store, day, uh, dairy markets, and we we need our own. And the first thing, one of the first things we need to do, is shut down every fucking liquor store in the hood. We don't need no liquor stores, man. That ain't doing nothing but, man. You go in other white neighborhoods and Asian neighborhoods, ain't no fucking liquor stores. Ain't no liquor stores. <laughs> man.
All 100% I need I needed this message. Hey, hey, y'all good. Cornelius Crump say I believe in Jesus. So do I. Phantasmus uh uh Preto say you big man. <laughs> Dale Reed say OG gangster man, we all got to stand strong together and that's man, we got to come together, man. That's my whole purpose of being on here, man. I could be doing anything. I ain't got to be on here. I, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to get mine. I'm going to hustle. I know I'm going to be all right. You know what I'm saying? God willing, because I know God is with me. I ain't got to be on here, but I feel obligated, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel, man, that God put me on here to do this, man. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do God's will. You know what I'm saying? We got to come together, man. That's real. We got to come together. That's the only way that we can be who we really are. That's the only way that we're going to be able to teach our children the truth. And that's real. The truth is only going to come from us. The truth can't come from others, man. Phantasma say, yeah, I've been in jail. Hey, we, so have I. <laughs> Mike Lorenzo say facts. Marcus say, uh, a lot of young kids can work can work with me in the electrical field, want quick money, but can't do simple tasks. They just need to be taught. That's all. You know what I'm saying? No. They just need to be educated, man. Need to be taught. Benny Joseph say, uh, against me too because I don't have money. Mike say, uh, there's limited funding for us to start businesses, but They'll give foreigners money. Yeah, they give them the store. Look what they're doing to these motherfuckers that's coming over the border. They putting them in houses. They feeding them. They giving them $9,000 a month. You know what I'm saying? And we live here and can't get shit. How you going to get them money? They ain't put a dime in the country. Boy, boy. Sick wine say that ain't a lie. Universal Factory say, uh... Jesse Patterson. What the hell is doing the hell is Jesse Patterson, man? Is you going to say who he is or you going to just keep hollering Jesse Patterson? Benny Joseph say, uh, ain't just Asians. Man, no. But in our neighborhoods, it's Asians in the black community. It's mostly Asians, man. Them the all the ones that's hollering about dog. We don't take uh, the EBT. We don't take debit card. We don't take credit card. How you ain't gonna take a debit card? That's money in the fucking bank. <laughs> Figure it out. Dunkley family say uh, our difference between Australian black and American blacks is we have respect from government agencies because we have our blacks stepping up getting and there to support us. You sound so sad. Much love from Australia. Because all we got is black sellouts. The blacks are supposed to be in there speaking for us. Once they get in there, they are all, they just sellouts, man. You know what I'm saying? They sell us out. Mike say we need to protect the black community and, and get our black owned business. We got to get our black owned businesses back, man. Benson O'Brien say, how cares about who cares about the price? Support our community. Exactly. When you go anywhere else, you ain't crying about no price because they don't want to hear that crap. But when you come to a brother, you want a deal. Oh, well, can I get two for three? Can I get to get three for five? Come on, man. O'Neill Williams say, uh, every time I'm on here and see you on, I get on. And listen, knowledge is power. Without a doubt it is, and that's what we need. We got to educate our kids and educate each other, man. You know what I'm saying? Because knowledge is power. Burrito Master say nothing but love, man. Keep spreading the truth. Thank you, my brother. Press and Props will say salute, OG. Salute G-Riders family. Dot Smooth say, uh... How you doing, gangster? I'm chilling, man. Hey, man, I'm, I'm maintaining them. You know what I'm saying? Andre Stewart say, OG, white man, worse, 
Worst enemy is the educated black man, real without a doubt. What that say, Gubby Fish, 31. Love it, man. Truth, appreciate you. Dunkley family say, love the pic of that handsome man behind you. Yeah, that, uh, that handsome man behind me, that was my son, man. Uh, he passed last year, man. It's just, man, that, that's a pain that, man, that's something that, man, I could never get over, man. But thank you, though. Appreciate it. Sig Wine say, uh, that shit tripped me out. As you said, Lope, that's right. Mr. Uh, say, uh, a lot of people don't want to work. Man, that's, man, it's people want to work, man. The ones that don't want to work, so what? Let them, if they want to starve, that's on them. At the end of the day, but there's plenty of us, there's plenty of people that want to work. Mike Lorenzo say black people can make a mighty, mighty fist to fight back for our communities and the kids' further future if we come together as one. And that's what we all about over here, coming together as one, man. Sigwan say, I support you to the fullest, OG. Appreciate you, Sigwan. Richard Wise say, one band, one sound. Mike Lorenzo say, black people love to work too. Yes, we do. By you 504 say, my dad and mom, I just can't cut cuss around them. No, I can't neither. I can't neither. Sigwan say, damn, that's right. By you 504 say, Caleb or Michelle put that website up so I can order me some merch. Hey, hey, by you, hit my, hit my line. Call me, we can do it. We can, yeah, hit my line. Put my, put my phone number up there, somebody. Mike Lorenzo say black people as one is stronger than ever if we come together as one and grow. Without a doubt, man. Without a doubt, we got to come together. Mike Lorenzo say boycott the liquor stores in the black community. That's what we got to, but we need to, yeah, we need to do that. We need to boycott all the bullshit and get all the bullshit up out of there, man. Get all the bullshit up out of there, man. Mr. 160 say, what up, G? I don't know what it's going to take for our black people to see that all we really have is ourselves. Man, that's real, man. Mike Lorenzo say more black investors and more black protesters. We don't even need to do no protesting. All we got to do is invest and don't spend our money with them. That's for real. Richard Wise say, we all got nobody coming to save us. We got to save ourselves. g Rider, stand up. And that's real. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, the website should be back up today, well, tomorrow. But you can hit me and still order. You can order whatever you want from me. Just up, yeah, there go my number right there. Just hit me. Sion, say, uh, what up, OG? What's up, Sion? By you 504, say, uh, let's not forget the uh, India folks. It's coming up in our month. Yeah. Them racist motherfuckers, too. <laughs> yeah. Them 7-Elevens, all them, too. All for all of them. Get them all up out of here, man. Conrad Maceo say, Mofo needs to chill with that. Do you believe in God? Or you, a, yeah, that ain't, that, that, don't, don't, that, don't worry about that, man. Joe Frank say, what's up, partner? Partner, partner. What's up, Joe Frank? What up, partner? King Cobra say, uh, 
Watch, watch out for Taylor's clear skin cream. I don't even use none of that, man. <laughs> I don't use none of that shit. I don't even use lotion, man. I don't use none of that. Prime Rabbit say our family, the black community went from having the greatest example of family life in North America back in the 60s to becoming a stereotype for the broken family dynamic in modern times. And that's real. But that was uh, that was systematically done by the white folks, man. You know, we can't blame it all on us. They said that's why they wouldn't let the father be in the home. Man, hey, man they didn't did so much to us. It's crazy, man. The trail walker said, yep, gee, I will go back to all our swap meets and Compton, Asians and other swap. Man, man, for real. Get them, you know. That's crazy how you had that big ass Compton swap meet that used to be Sears, upstairs and downstairs. And you didn't have no Asians, didn't have no brothers or sisters working in none of their spots, man. And we right in the middle of Compton. Joe Frank say the ones that that have don't that have don't think about us that don't. You right about that? Cause once they got it, they like I got mine. <laughs> they got to get theirs the best way they can. So many ways say oh uh, we just got to figure out how to get it ourselves. Man, we know how to get it ourselves. We just got to come together, homie. That's all we got to do, man. See on feeder say uh fifth for feeder say uh you got me hooked on that jam by Rick James happy yeah that's a bad mofo huh that's a bad QP say uh same here G I gotta get back in church feel like the devil got a noose at times yeah you gotta get in there hit that word J Wolf say. If the Asians move out and the black people move in, the neighborhood stores, it's up to all of us to keep it going. We act like we don't want to give each other's chance to support the store. We got it. Are we the same store the Asians had? Whatever they were selling, that's what we gonna sell. You know? Yeah, we gotta support. That's the only way it's gonna stay, it's gonna survive. You right about that. Dot Smooth say, happy days always, G. QP say, hey, Michelle. Really? F now for our Supreme said, hi, what's up? Say, is P. Diddy guilty? What you think, man? Don't ask me if he's guilty. What you think? You know, from what you've seen, what you think? Kenneth Robinson say, uh, I am 67 years old. I pray to God that I get to see our black-owned businesses come back to our hoods like it was, like it once was in the 60s and 70s. And in our 50s, it it would be so great, OG. Yeah, it sure would. That's up to us, though. We could do it. We just got to come together. So many ways, say, uh, the young ones really be grinding, they just have to, too many distractions, just have to keep trying and don't give up. No, we can't give up on them, never that. Digging, digging, what's going on? Dot Smooth say on the real, great people out here there, G, I know it is. By you 504 say, uh, thank you, Michelle. Mike said, if we stop spending our money with them, most of them are through. Without a doubt, they are. They ain't finna stay where they ain't making no money. They don't give a damn about us. James Gass say, some of these dudes in here act like they, they don't know any history before 2010. <laughs> Mike Lorenzo say, much respect, facts. Mike Lorenzo say, one day at a time, my black people. Yeah, we can't do it, but one day at a time, but we got to do it. We got to do it. You know what I'm saying? 
James Cash said, I've been tripping off stuff that happened 25 years ago. Everything in life happens for a reason. Stan, what's up, Stan? Say hello, everyone. One band, one sound. Stan the man, what's up? But listen, man. This whole podcast was about us coming together and us spending our money together, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I didn't listen to Frank Sinatra. Yeah, listen, man, we got to listen, man. We got to learn, we got to learn how to come together, man. And You know what I'm saying? We got, I don't listen, man. Ain't nothing stopping us. It's only one thing stopping us from achieving everything that we want. One thing. And that's unity, man. All we need is unity. If we got unity, the world is ours, man. God done made it to where all we got to do is come together. People hollering about them waiting on God. God waiting on us. He done made it to where the civil rights movement provided everything we needed to succeed. Everything we needed to succeed that came from the civil rights movement, man. And all we got to do is join together, man. Open our own banks, our own businesses, and our own schools, man. Nobody's going to teach our kids, man, what they need to know. Ain't nobody going to... Why would they teach our kids the truth? They not even teaching their own kids the truth. They kids will never know what really happened because they, unless they investigate, they not teaching their own kids. So why would you think they would teach our kids? Hey, man, I just want to thank all y'all for tuning in. Y'all could have been anywhere, you know, but y'all was here with me, man, and I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? I definitely appreciate it, man. And everybody on here, man, that's what we about here, this G-Riders movement, man. Everybody in every state, I don't care whatever country you in, Australia, wherever you at, if you on here, you a G-Rider. And you need to be, you need to be, G rod that G mean God. We riding for God. We God's riders, you know? And we need to bring our people together. Man, man, you're not strong. Man, we strong separated. You're not strong, we'll be uh, united. Ain't nothing, like I said, ain't nothing stopping us from getting what we want but unity. I need everybody on here in every, whatever state, every country, whatever country, whatever city you in, you need to start a chapter of the G-Riders, man. We need to bring as many people as we can to this platform so when we make a move, we making a move all over the country, all over the world. It got to start somewhere. It's our time, man. This is our time. You know what I'm saying? If we don't do it, it ain't going to be done. Our players are never... Hurt, harm, or disrespect another brother or another sister, man. All I want us to do is live and let live. Bring our people together, you know what I'm saying, so that we can be what we supposed to be, man. We God's chosen people, man. We God's chosen people, man. We the real Hebrew Israelites, man. We them people. Man, God didn't bring us up, um, up out of Egypt to let us roam 40 years in the desert to spread us all across the world as slaves, to free us, and then it just end like this? No! We still got stuff to do, man. We got to show the world who we really are. We got to show the world that the devil is a lie. <laughs> the devil is a lie, man. When you know better, you got to do better. You see your sister or your brother walking down the street in the mall, in the park, anywhere. Don't turn your head to shy away from them when you walk by them. Look them right in the eye and say hi or say hello, man. That's it. If they don't speak back, so what? But if we keep speaking, man, if we keep speaking, man, they going to get it. And they going to start speaking back, man. Love y'all, man. I'm up out of this B.I.